this is a new form. Tell me about this. Uh, I was so surprised <laughs> in a good way uh, when we saw the model, but it's new for you. Well, if, if the shape is new, but not the soul, let's say, or the concept, because uh, my aspiration is always to try to create a dialogue in between body and soul. Mm -hmm. and, and, and this piece has a certain contradiction because it looks like something very industrial in the bottom, which is this kind of cylinder that looks like a, a piston almost mm -hmm. from one engine. Mm -hmm. And then this so spiritual line of letters mm -hmm. from different alphabets. Uh, and, and, and I guess it seems in a stairway to reach the sky, to reach mm -hmm. the heaven. Every time that I'm seeing a, a new sculpture, it's, uh, my obsession is to verify the, my intuitions because we, we visit together, you and I, the piece in the workshop mm -hmm. near my studio in Barcelona. Mm -hmm. But when the piece is really in, in its sides, it's changed completely mm -hmm. because it starts the dialogue with the, with the surroundings. When you came the first time, there was no museum, there was uh, no endless, there was a big uh, pile of grass <laughs> and a fence, I think. Uh, what has changed uh, from that very first visit and then another visit to come and to see this piece here that's different? Uh, I'm very emotional as an artist and, and my relationship with you has been in so long time that, uh, I mean, Wherever you are, it's, a, it's a, like a house for me or a place to be. That means with or without the museum. And I guess you explained me so well your dreams about it mm -hmm. that, okay, I guess today we are verifying also not only my dreams, but also yours. Yeah. The material that mm -hmm. I choose, which is a stainless steel, is reflecting the light in a very nice way. Uh, especially in front of the building, which is this very neutral color, let's mm -hmm. say. Mm -hmm. uh, very classic, very calm, mm -hmm. very quiet, mm -hmm. uh, very silent. Mm -hmm. I, I always consider a museum a public space, mm -hmm. always. I don't know why many times they, they are working in separate ways, but I guess the museum is the house of everybody. I mean, it's the, really the, the house of knowledge. I mean, uh, and, and, and I always consider a museum mm -hmm. a public space. For me, the most important thing is to take in consideration mm -hmm. the community that we will be using that space. Mm -hmm. Because, well, I'm installing a piece in the house of somebody else. Mm -hmm. and, and, and I have to find a link in between my dreams and the dreams of the community mm -hmm. living and using that space. Doesn't matter if it's a museum or a plaza, or if it's in the middle of the nature, or mm -hmm. in, the, in downtown one street. I mean, I think, for me, the most important is people. You know, the surprise for me in this, uh, endeavor was leaving the building not coming up to the building but leaving the building and i sent you an image the other day because it just sends you to the skies it just sends you to the heavens mm -hmm. and i wasn't anticipating that yeah and yeah. it really uh as just a general person yeah. it took me someplace i wasn't anticipating yeah, yeah because that piece I'm pleased about it. It's uh, a fantastic excuse to look it up. Mm -hmm. Because many times for our problems, for many reasons, we, we are always looking mm -hmm. down and, and we need things that help us to look it up, mm -hmm. to look at the sky, the clouds. And the piece will be so precise, like a, a dot saying, we are here. Mm -hmm. And I guess for Notre Dame was important. Mm -hmm. Many times, when I'm thinking about uh, the characters or alphabets from different languages in the world, finally I'm always thinking about the human being when he's talking. Mm -hmm. Because our body is like a music instrument and we are making a sound, mm -hmm. which is our voice. And here it's some notes going up and up and up, trying to reproduce the voices of so many. Mm -hmm. I think 
the quality of, of one of the most important parts of us is our boys. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, many times uh, we, we have a tremendous capacity to destroy those voices, but my, my pieces are always an homage to humanity, mm -hmm. but plenty of sound. My pieces are trying to celebrate silence, mm -hmm. but because they are frozen, the sound of so many voices. When I've been in front of the museum, I've been happy about why I chose that piece for that place, because I guess it's so many voices from artists, mm -hmm. from people who love art, mm -hmm. from people which could find the link between art and spirituality, that mm -hmm. for me is very important. Mm -hmm. and, and we are in Notre Dame, which is a university, it's the house of knowledge, it's, it's, a, it's, it's the palace of wisdom, it's, it's the place where people mm -hmm. could grow and develop ideas and dreams. And I think that uh, sculpture could represent pretty well mm -hmm. all that the university is trying to pass to others. Mm -hmm. This, you could do it, you mm -hmm. could become something else. Mm -hmm. I guess the most important is to pass this idea that everything has a big question mark. Mm -hmm. And that is the engine that moves the life going on. And, uh, and, and every time I've been teaching, the most extraordinary thing is to put questions, mm -hmm. not to say answers. Mm -hmm. And I guess I hope that peace for them will be a big, a big question. Yeah.